Hi, my name is Alyssa. Welcome back to my channel. If you're new, welcome. Today I'm going to be showing y'all how I tandem carry with two ring slings. My twins are six months old. They are both under 15 pounds right now, but these can hold up to, I believe, 40-ish pounds each. So yeah. So first we're going to start with one and make sure it is all waved out <laughs> and flattened out, no tangles. Then you're gonna take this and put it around your shoulder, making sure you keep the top part up and that goes around your back flat. And then you're going to take the tails and fold them together like this and pull them through the ring slings, both of the rings. Then you want to straighten out again and then take your fingers and find both ends, separate them, take your fingers and kind of fix it out, fan it out with your fingers so there is no crinkles and no catches. And then after you do that, you're going to take these ends together again and then split the rings and put them both through. And then you're gonna do the fanning out trick again to make sure that there are no catches. So once you have this first one on, you're gonna to wanna to make sure right away that the bottom is kind of tightened already. And then you're going to put this all the way back up because once you start tightening, it's, the rings are gonna probably end up towards your mid chest. Before you put a baby in, you wanna go ahead and set up your second sling. So we're gonna do this one kind of the same. You gotta make sure that it's fanned out. But instead, this one is going to be going on the other shoulder. And you're going to take the ends after you straighten it out. You're going to take the ends together again. And then move that out of the way. Then you go under the first sling and then through the first rings. Both of the rings at the same time. And then make sure that your fabric is straightened out all the way. And then fan it out with your fingers, no catches, no overlaps. And you take the tails like you did with the first one and go through both of the rings and you just fan out. We don't want to have any catches because it's going to make tightening pretty impossible. And yep, and then we slide that one to the top. And right now you'll look kind of like this. Both of the rings are at the top of your shoulder. They're crisscrossed in the back, and then they're both equally fanned out, kind of tightened at the bottom. Then you take your first baby on the first sling you put on. Take your first model. This one is Aspen. Then you put her up on your shoulder. Be careful. <laughs> And then take all the fabric and slide her in both legs. And you get a good seat. And a good seat is going to be tucked up under her butt or his butt. I have girls. And then making sure their arms are both in the top of the fabric. And a good seat is also where their legs are kind of in an M. So you want their fabric up under. And then you start tightening. So I like to tighten the bottom first and the bottom is going to be 
this side of your fabric and then you kind of bring the fabric around and pull to tighten the top. And I kind of fold it down just a little bit and then you just keep tightening. My fabric is a little caught. There we go. And then you tighten the middle. And then there is, oops, she's got the second tail. There is the first seat. Okay, so we're gonna move this tail around and then we're gonna get our second model. So to do this, you kind of have to move your arm over. Make sure that tail is out of our way. And then try your hardest. If you need assistance, that's probably a better thing to do. I don't recommend tandem wearing until you've at least gotten comfortable with wearing a single baby at a time. And then you do the same thing with her. Make sure she's got a good seat. Her legs are up under there really good and the fabric is tucked under her butt. And then fabric around and then we start tightening. This one might be a little harder to do, but you bring under the rings to tighten up easier. here and pull. Just make sure you keep bringing this fabric up and around to make sure you get it as tight as you can while being as comfortable for baby and you. And then bring that back. And right now you just need to adjust. So she is kind of falling a little bit. We want to fix that as much as we can. Tighten both up as much as we can. The rings kind of are getting a little blocked. She's starting to get a little fussy because it's close to nap time. There we go. And I just pull it up, tighten. Lots and lots of tightening, lots and lots of adjusting. But there we go. And both of my slings, I'll try to link them down in the description. I got them from Amazon. They're called the Blow Cup Ring Slings. They have a lot of different color options and they were only $30 each, which is very, very good because prices for a tandem usually cost in the like upper hundreds, two hundreds. And this one's very affordable. We always love that, love a good deal, especially when you have to buy two of everything. And these come with pockets for like your phone and your keys, really great for walks if you just wanna carry them and not like have a big bulky stroller. But yeah, and this is what we look like. And this is what our back looks like. It's kind of crisscrossed and they're nice and comfortable on my hips and you always want to make sure you're in kissing distance with the foreheads. Yep. So to take them off, what we have to do is do one at a time, obviously, but I like to work backwards from how I ended. So I'll loosen up second baby and then kind of pull the fabric, loosen her up and then pull her out and then set her down somewhere safe. So I'm gonna put her in the crib. And then we loosen up the other sling. Pull her out and that's it for taking the babies out. 
And usually to just go ahead and set myself up for next time, I do not take them off just like this. I just loosen them out and I do have to readjust every time, like from the start, putting them in, but it's okay. Take one off. And if it's easier for you to leave them already as situated, just taking them off crisscrossed, you can go ahead and do that, but that's what works for me and I hope this helped at least a little. So that was how I tandem carry with two ring slings for my twins and they can carry up to about 40-ish pounds. Um, super affordable, only $30 per ring sling. Always a great thing to have something that cheap, you know? And they are very sturdy and very comfortable. It's cotton fabric, so it's not gonna get too, too heavy and it's not gonna get <laughs> too hot. If you are outside carrying them for a long time, of course it is going to get hot, but it's very breathable for me at least so far. I haven't had to wear them in the summertime yet, but you know, we'll see how it goes. And if there's anything else you want to see, just drop a comment below. If you have any questions, just ask me. I try to reply to all the comments. And yeah, thank you for watching. <laughs> like and subscribe if you want to. You don't have to. Bye.